What is up guys, welcome to my channel and today we are back with some of the reaction for the Dan Master Season 2 Episode 8. Alright guys, last of all, quite a lot of stuff is happening, okay, Star, we're seeing a lot more of what this star, star really is. She's pretty crazy, she don't really care, so she is after Belle because of, uh, she found out, thanks to Hermes, that she found out that Freya is interested in him. And it seems like she, they got beef going on, Goddess of Beauty and Goddess of Love, you get me, kind of makes sense, I guess, rival, you know what I'm saying. So yeah, they both can charm, which is pretty crazy, and now, since she knows that Freya is, you know, kind of interested in Belle, she's trying to get Belle for herself, so yeah, there's, there's something crazy about to go down, she has told her family to go and kidnap my man. So, obviously, where's, where's the best place to kidnap? Dungeon, right? So, yeah, it's not going well, is what I'm trying to say. So, yeah, anyway, I'm not going to bail on too much. Crazy amount, all because of freaking Hermes snitching. If you hadn't said anything about Belle, I don't think she would be actually interested, to be honest, right? So, yeah, I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm not going to bail on too much with that. Means that let's go ahead and check the episode 8 out. Let's go. Yeah, we also got to see this. I don't know. I think that's probably Haruhime, right, guys? Because I did look into the... You see that necklace thing, right? I'm pretty sure she had that necklace, you know what I'm saying? That black necklace. So that has to be Harimis. Yeah, I don't know. Like, and I did say that she's almost level four, though. So I'm um, plus. She got this freaking buff-looking thing going on. This aura thing. Yo, Aisha, what the fuck? I mean, I guess she is, right? I don't know. It's hard to. Uh, it's hard to pay attention. <laughs> My boy, L. She. Oh. Damn. Yo, she crazy. What the. F Oh, there you go. That is that is Harime. She didn't know. She didn't know. Damn. Okay. There's no way we're getting out of this family. This family is just next level, freaking insane. These 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 girls are crazy. My man's in a prison already. Fucking it. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god. I can't. Yeah. Nah, bro. My boy. Find that toad. Uh, you're kidding me. You just left that toad take my man. Uh, hey, but Harima, release my girl. Okay, there you go. There you go. Okay, I was like, man, what, what, what's she doing? You know, she just came. I'm sorry. And what? Oh my god, I can't watch this. No, oh god, somebody help my man. No, oh god. So this, this freaking toad likes to freaking torture people. Goddesses are the number one, right? The rule, right? But look at that, look at this thing. She don't care. Oh my god. This is, I did not ask for this. If it was Aisha, it was a different story, but... <laughs> I can't... What the fuck is wrong with this thing, bro? I was, I was losing hope. I thought nobody would know. Cause like like that toad said, no one knows. Haruhime. Hey yo, thank you, God damn. Haruhime out here becoming the hero right now, by the way. Saving my boy, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Them tail be pretty nice, I ain't gonna lie. Uh we gotta run by the way. We ain't got no time to be, you know, just Hey my god, girl, observation hockey, what the fuck I didn't know? That is observation hockey, right? Yeah, that is observation hockey. Damn, I wonder how big her range is though. <laughs> Damn, Haruhime is being clutch, bro. I ain't gonna lie. She out here saving us twice already, bro. Oh, the toad. Damn, how do you know though? Oh, she saw the freaking toad torturing someone. Oh, God. That would have been Bill. Oh, my God, guys. What the fuck? Okay, God damage. This one's pretty. She almost got her, what the fuck? <laughs> she looked pretty cool too, but I gotta chill. Okay, guys, you can't fucking blame me, all right? Some of them are freaking hella good. You looking, you know what I'm saying? I mean, Aisa seems to have like a... She seems to like kind of like care a little bit about her human. She even bought her the candies and stuff. That's where... I don't know about that anymore because the goddess fucking wants you, my man. Uh, my boy's trying his best. You know what I'm saying? But I don't think Goddess is going to sell her anymore because of Belle, right? Because if Belle goes in front of her, she's definitely going to freaking devour my man. What the fuck? That damn rabbit make another one? What the fuck you want about, you piece of shit? Who's that? That guy looked like freaking from the Loki family, the Tundra dude. I forgot his name. But that's not. I think that guy is from the freaking Freya family. 
Ereris. Hmm, okay. Okay, some god knows about the guy that killing stone. Look at how good she don't even know about this. So what what is it? Tukumiki Sama. Tukumichi. Tak Takumichi. I'm sorry, I don't know. Having the stone gives you access to powerful luna magic known as Yujutsu. Some sort of magic. Is that the magic that the Haruhima was using in Aisha, maybe? To use okay, so you need the killing stone to use the magic power? <clears throat> you satter it. So as soon as the shield you satter it can never be. So that's what they're trying to do with Haruhime. Mm, that's why Haruhime was like just happy when Belle said we're here to save you. Cause she knows she's she knows what's gonna happen to her. Okay, G fucking G ah. G fucking G. That's, everything's happening too damn quick right now. There's no way. We are not prepared for this, bruh. Okay, my boy out. Thanks to Harahime. Damn. Yeah, I don't know, bro. We gotta save Harahime, bro. The magic. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, so Ista always know. What the fuck? So that's what he was. I thought he was just a goddamn necklace, bro. I think she does. Yeah, she does. She's already accepted her fate, seems like. Because they've already told her what she's here for. She was sold here. Who sold her, man? That's what I want to know. War with Freya, right? Yeah, clearly. They want to go on war with Freya family. Yeah. Yep. So they've been preparing for this shit for a while, eh? How can... How big can it even be? Level boosting? Level boosting? We're level boosting? What the fuck? So she can level boost you? Holy shit, she's crack. Long time ago. There you go. See? So Harahimi always knew. So they were preparing for all this for like a long time. Yeah. Apparently not. Well, who are we talking about right now, by the way? Are we not childhood come from far? See? So she's talking about herself right now. Ice is talking about herself. Am I right? Some thugs somewhere had deceived some thugs. So, okay. So it's not Hermes. I'm sorry. She destroyed a precious stone that had been put. Don't tell me. Of course what she's done. So Aisha. Hey, yo. Hey, hey, yo. What the hell? Okay, I was not expecting. Well, yo, she didn't do everything. Okay, okay. I know it's something pretty serious. Okay, that was, but I, that was pretty. I don't know, man. This is so fucked up. If I say, it, but I was not expecting that. Is what I'm trying to say. So clearly, Aisha is talking about herself, right? So seems like Harima would have died a long time ago. Okay, so they already knew about her. So Harima would have died. Aisha basically saved her. So that just shows that she actually does care for her, despite you know she's acting that toughness from the, but she definitely does care because she destroyed the stone before so they had to find another one which is why she got punished told freaking like tortured her for, and the Istar had her way with her so yeah that is pretty crazy so definitely Aisha always have been cared for Harahime it seems like for some reason you know so which is pretty crazy she's kind of like a mom to Harahime it was a big war guy that we ain't going with a small family as a freaking big family so I, I like it my boy's actually thinking but I feel like he's definitely gonna see. She's kind of basically telling him to come and take her. You don't have a piece of a man. Hey, hey, hey. My boy's a hero. What you on about? Yeah, see. Oh, I know she. See, she cares for her, guys. I don't know, man. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I should definitely cares for Harry. Man. All right. Okay. Quite a goddamn episode. So we're kind of figuring out a lot, lot more about Ista as well. So Ista don't care. Who, I guess at the end of the day, she is the goddess of love. So she wouldn't care who the hell she's dealing with. You know what I'm saying? She would do with anybody. So it's pretty crazy. But anyway, we got more info about uh, Harry Hime and Aisha here. 
clearly. So yeah, it is confirmed that Haruhime was sold by some just just some thug that actually deceived her. So Haruhime is pretty nice, so you kind of you can kind of see you know she being deceived. So pretty, it's tragic, you know. She got sold here, and everything was already prepared. So they were actually ready to go on war with Freya a long time ago. It seems like I'm not sure how long that was, but yeah, they were ready. They had the stone, but Aisha had already kind of started to care for you know Haruhime, which is why she went in and destroyed the killing stone, right? And then she got punished for it. Toad freaking tortured the hell out of her. She was bleeding everywhere, and then freaking goddess comes, and then she has her own way with her. So yeah, Aisha definitely. I don't know. She probably. It's crazy, you know. What I'm saying Aisha definitely care for her. Like you know, she kind of felt like. Just because the way how Harihime was not talking to anybody, always not crying, like, you know, maybe she felt something and she was like, okay, yeah, I, well, I want to protect her or something. I don't know. She kind of basically is like a mom to Harihime. You get what I'm saying? Because she was out there for her, despite Harihime not really knowing what was going on. Like, you know, I don't think Harihime knew the full detail of what Aisha went through to save her, like, basically, you know, before. But now, clearly she can't because they will probably have, her eye, have their eyes on, you know, Aisha, plus they're not going to leave the Killing Stone like that. Because, you know, yeah, I don't know. So, I like I said, just the way how, you know, Aisha was talking to Belle. Kind of seemed like uh, she basically is like telling him, come and take her. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, you know, if he, if you don't, then she's going to die. You know, basically that's what I get, got from it. And another thing we got confirmed. So, Harumi has a freaking uh, spell or magic, which basically boosts your level. So, which is pretty insane. I'm not sure how crazy the boosting level is. Like, per, like, does it count as XP boosting? Or, like, does she basically boost the goddamn level? If she's boosting the whole level, does that mean that Aisha is level 3? So, does that mean she's freaking level 4 when she was fighting Belle? Like, that is not normal. That is insanity. That That is just not a normal thing. Which is why it makes sense why Freya is trying to go on war with... Like, I'm sorry, Ista is, Ista is trying to go on war with Freya. Because... If the magic thing just, you know, happens just the way how they're trying to do, like, you know, killing Haruhime and all that thing. And if that boosting does work, hey, yo, that is insanity. That is not normal. So that is pretty crazy. I'm hoping somehow my boy can going to man up and hopefully try to save her. I don't fucking know how. But yeah, well, this is not looking good in our favor, to be honest. But one thing is the dog freaking the wolf dude knows. And we do know that wolf dude is from Freya family. And so I'm hoping maybe Freya might try to intervene or something because I'm pretty sure Freya knows, right, that Esther is trying to go on war with her, right? Come on, there's no way. We're talking about Freya here, okay? She basically knows fucking everything. She's know what what what's happening everywhere, you know what I'm saying? So I'm pretty sure that she's aware that Esther is preparing for war with her. So I don't know. I get the feeling that she might make a move too. Otherwise, I can't see us doing anything, to be honest. There's no way we can deal with this family. Here. No way. No matter how you look at it. It is not a polar family, bro. Like, these guys are all crazy level, high level. No way in hell we're dealing with it. The only thing that I can think of is basically Freya somehow getting intervened or like somehow coming in. And maybe that's going to work out. But I don't know. Like I said, you know, this is not looking in our favor is what I'm trying to say. But anyway, guys, hope you guys did like this more reaction. If you guys did, make sure you guys smash the like button. Don't forget to subscribe button and the notification bell, guys. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. I want to see you in slow motion. Come stay the night. We can stay up till it's bright. In the morning, got the top open.